display. Because in the heat of battle, what you see on screen can make or break all the difference between winning and losing. Now, the Realme 13 5G has a 120Hz FHD Plus high comfort display, and this 6.72 inch high definition display brings vibrant, sharp visuals with, of course, a 1080 and 2400 resolution, plus a peak brightness of 690 nits. Now, imagine. You're in the middle of a game, an FPS game, and pinaplan mo yung perfect headshot mo. What you need then is a clear and vibrant display with a lot of touch response to achieve this. And it can reach up to 120 hertz for a super smooth performance, but if you're the type naman who will chill, watch your favorite anime, and scroll through socials, it dials back down to save power. So you get maximum performance and efficiency exactly as you need it. Because with a six level dynamic refresh rate, the phone adjusts based on the activity on your phone, plus the eye comfort display feature reduces eye strain during long hours of gameplay, or even just binge watching. But that's not all, because I know that all of us here are already familiar or are not strangers to Realme's Rainwater Smart Touch. This feature allows the device to maintain accurate touch response to keep you in control even with wet hands or a wet stream. And with all of these display features combined, you'll be able to see every detail and navigate your game like a pro. Let's talk about storage and memory, because in gaming you need speed and a storage capacity large enough to win. With the Realme 13 5G, it comes equipped with 26 plus 256 gigabytes of massive storage. So let me break that down for you. The device has up to 26 gigabytes of total RAM, which consists of 12 gigabytes of physical RAM, and of course, 14 gigabytes of virtual RAM through Realme's dynamic RAM expansion. And with this, you can run up to 19 or even more apps simultaneously in the background without breaking a sweat. Then you can also switch easily between music streaming, like on Spotify, video calls, like on Discord, and even your in-game matches. And with a internal storage of 256 gigabytes, you have room for everything and anything that you want to put on your phone. You can stash up to 1,000 plus episodes of your favorite series or shows, 60,000 songs, or even up to 70 games in total. And you won't need to worry about running out of space anytime soon, so go ahead, download that massive game update you've been waiting for, and play ahead. Because the Realme 13 5G has the power and the space to handle all of those things. Now, I want to mention the design of both models. So the Realme 13 Series 5G comes or boasts a victory speed design. And this features bold colors, sleek curves, which convey speed and performance. The Realme 13 5G comes in speed green and dark purple, while the Realme 13 Plus 5G comes in victory gold and dark purple. Now I want to ask you, what's your favorite colorway of the Realme 13 Series 5G? Can I get a shout out on what your favorite color is? Who's up for gold here? Okay, so you know how a dark purple. Sinoja ang mahilig sa speed green. Oh, okay. Alam ko na kung sino yung winning color natin. But ako, preference ko, victory gold champlet. Because one, it exudes boldness and the capacity to win. Nux. Okay. Lastly, the Realme 13 Series 5G or Realme 13 5G also comes equipped with GT mode and a cutting edge vapor chamber cooling system. But I'll leave it to our special guests to dive deeper. And of course, talk about those features later on. So I hope you guys are excited because the Realme 13 Plus 5G is up next. Thank you and stay tuned. Specifically, the experience namin with GT mode and the vapor chamber cooling system. Excited na talaga kami pag-usapan to dahil na try na namin mismo kung paano ito napapagana and napapaganda yung performance ng game namin. Yan, tama yan, Waes. Unahin natin ang GT Mode. Itong GT Mode kasi nasa Realme GT Series na siya. 
Most recently, it's a Realme GT6. Kaya feeling ko, most of all na nandito ngayon is may idea na huwag it does. Yan. For sure, kapag gamit mo ang GT mode, alam agad ng phone kung saan siya dapat mag-focus, which is doon sa game mo. It gives you high image quality, high frame rate na 90 FPS, or even higher, kahit pang matagal at payang laro mo. And syempre, we tried playing other games using the Realme 13 Plus 5G. At nakita naman ang malaking difference sa gameplay kapag gamit ang GT Mode. Yeah. So first game, hindi pa namin gamit ang GT Mode. As expected, magandang performance pa rin dahil ang Realme 13 Plus 5G ay powerful na on its own. Yan, yeah, totoo yan. And syempre, ibang usapan naman kapag naka-on na ang GT Mode. If gusto nyo gamitin ang GT Mode, there are two ways to turn it on. Yeah. The first one is swipe left para pumunta sa sidebar menu in-game. Katulad ng nakikita nyo dito sa screen, makikita nyo ang GT mode tapos i-click nyo lang. Ang second way, pwede nyo rin siyang buksan sa drop-down menu kahit naka in-game ka or hindi. Meron pang full animation pag turn mo nito. Itong GT mode talagang nagbigay siya ng tubo sa performance namin. Naging mas stable ang gameplay namin at consistent talaga siya kahit ilang oras na kaming naglalari. And ito naman, para sulit talaga ang gameplay nyo sa so, Realme 3 and Plus 5G, ang masasabi ko lang sa inyo ay hindi to umiin kahit ang tagal nilang naglalaro. Dahil meron ito, Vapor Chamber Cooling System. Yan. Ang mga phones talaga natin ay prone to heating, lalo na kapag heavy game title ang nilalaro. Pansin niya rin ba na pag ang init-init na ng phone mo after hours of playing? Kasi ang ibang phones, hindi efficient ang cooling system nila katulad nitong Realme 13 Plus 5G. Yes, kasi pinapalamig ng vapor chamber cooling system ang main sources of heat ng phone mo by up to 12 degrees. Mas efficient and mas mababang temperature kumpara sa ibang phones. Yan. Habang gamit namin yung Realme 13 Plus 5G for Hawk, inobserba na rin namin yung temperature ng phone to know kung gaano nga ba effective itong chamber cooling system. And to understand the benefit of this feature, tignan mo muna ang temperature ng phone mo bago starting a game. To do this, you can check dito sa sidebar menu in-game at makikita mo ang temperatures at top right hand corner and nakikita nyo na nasa 29 degrees lang ka. Habang tumaas slightly to 35 degrees from 29 degrees. Siyempre, kapag naglalaro ka ng MOBA, tataas talaga ang temperature. Pero good news ito dahil napakababa na ng 35 degrees compared to other smartphones. At pagkatapos naman ng game, makikita nyo na 2 degrees lang ang tinaas from 35 to 37 degrees. Sobrang baba talaga. Ibig sabihin, ang Realme 13 Plus 5G na ang pinaka-efficient when it comes to cooling systems. At kapag mababa ang temperature ng phone mo, it only means na kaya niya pang magbigay ng high frame rates at mas stable na performance kahit mga itong gaming sessions pa yan. Walang lag and distractions, no overheating at higis sa lahat. Top three performance lang dahil sa GT mode at V4 chamber cooling system. Kaya kahit final boss pa yung kalaban mo, kung matinding clash man yan, Kampante ka lang na kaya-kaya kong dalay ng Realme 13 Plus 5G to victory. Kaya ano pa ang hihintay nyo? Realme 13 Plus 5G na!